Governor Cuomo taking to the airwaves, scolding New York City officials for the delay in letting parents know the plan for school this fall. The school districts have prepared those and was supposed to send them in today uh, is the deadline. Uh, New York City uh, is late. That is unfortunate because parents want to see the plans so parents can respond. The governor said he's still on board with opening schools this September if the infection rate stays where it is or under 3%. Right now, the plan is blended learning, a mix of remote online learning and sitting in a classroom two to three days a week. Teachers will have to take a COVID-19 test before the first day of school and every month after. If one child in a classroom gets sick, then the entire class must quarantine for 14 days. If there's more than one positive case in different classrooms, then the school will close for at least 24 hours for cleaning and move to remote learning. Governor Cuomo bringing up a concern with the current backlog of testing in the city. How many tests are you going to do? What's the number? How do you do it? And how do you do it when you're already having trouble testing? The American Academy of Pediatrics says we need to get kids back to school, but there are risks, considering how fast germs spread in school. So we know they're going to be exposed. We know that children spread the illness as well. World-renowned pediatrician and best-selling author Harvey Karp says parents should be asking, how are we going to reduce the contamination in the classroom, including ventilation in New York City's old school buildings? Can we do testing? How fast will we get the results? And can we do uh, contact tracing then when you discover an outbreak and you will discover outbreaks? That's inevitable. It's a tough pill to swallow when you hear that from one of, one of America's top pediatricians. Also, the governor said the decision to open schools can change as fast as, as the rate of transmission here in New York City. He also said he will absolutely address the opening of schools by the end of next week. We're live on the Upper West Side outside LaGuardia High School. I'm Kalorama, Pix 11 News.